cry. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Let us begin to thank him for another grace to come together to continue in this passing and prayer. Today is the fourth day. Let us begin to thank God. Lord, we thank you. Father, we bless you. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for the strength of life. We thank you for the air that we breathe. Father, may your name be glorified. Father, we thank you. Holy Ghost, 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 Holy Ghost. we thank you. Father, I thank you for every one of us that have been participating in this person of grace. I thank you for your strength. I thank, thank you for your faithfulness. Oh, thank you, God. Glory be to God. Thank you, our Lord. Thank you, our God. Thank you, our Father. Yes. Thank you, oh Lord. We bless you. Yes. 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 Yes.
Father, position them to hear your word. Oh, Lord, our Father, convict them to receive you. Jesus, as their Lord and Savior, in the name of Jesus Christ, let the king, the, the gods of this world, let the devil lose his hold over them, in the name of Jesus. Let every evil blind that is covering them from coming to Christ be roasted by fire, in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah to the mighty God. Pray Jesus. Pray Jesus. Let us begin to plead the blood of Jesus upon our houses, where you are, your environment, your neighborhood, your compound, begin to plead the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus right now upon our environment, our atmosphere. We release the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus. We cover ourselves with the blood of Jesus. We cover our neighborhoods with the blood of Jesus. Our cities with the blood of Jesus. Our compound we release the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, we secure our environment by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank you, Jehovah. Thank you, mighty God. In Jesus' powerful name, amen, 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 hallelujah. I want us to also pray for those in prison that are innocent. Those in prison that are innocent, let the Lord open book of remembrance concerning them and let them be set free. Let the truth set them free. In the name of Jesus, Father, we bring those that are in prison, those that are innocent. We bring them before you right now, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Have mercy, open book of remembrance concerning them. Let them be set free in the name of Jesus. Let them be set loose in the name of Jesus. Let the truth make them free in the name of Jesus Christ. Those that have been locked up, that have been locked up wrongly, Father, we intercede for them. We intercede for their release. We intercede for their freedom. In the name of Jesus, we intercede for their release. We intercede for their freedom. In the name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I want you to pray this for yourself. Say, every wrong accusation against me, I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. Every wrong accusation against me, I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. Every wrong accusation. Every light against me, I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. I cancel it. I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. Wrong accusation. Every light against me, I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say, any mouth that is going about to assassinate my character, I condemn it right now. In the name of Jesus. Any mouth going about condemning my character, assassinating my character, I condemn that tongue right now. We condemn that tongue right now. In the name of Jesus, any personality that is going about to assassinate our character, we condemn it right now. In the name of Jesus, we condemn it. We condemn it in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah to the man of God. Say, any satanic image that is impersonating me in the spirit realm, be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Any satanic image impersonating me in the spirit realm be roasted by fire in the name of Jesus. Be destroyed by fire. Be destroyed by fire. Be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil image, evil image that is representing me in the spirit realm, that is misrepresenting me before my helpers, be destroyed by fire in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Please, if you, if you don't hear my the, the prayer very well, please ask me. I will repeat it. Pray Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Pray Jesus. The Bible says every tongue that rises against us, we shall condemn it. Hallelujah. We shall condemn it. The Bible also says, we shall lay anything to the charge of God's elect. It is God that justified. Say, oh Lord my God, justify me anywhere they have lied against me. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord my Father, arise in your mercy and justify me. Anywhere they have lied against me, oh Lord, justify me. Oh Lord, justify me. Oh Lord, justify me. In the name of Jesus, anywhere they have lied against me, Father, arise and justify me. In the name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Say, oh Lord, my God, anywhere they are rising against me, they have no voice. Raise a voice for me. Anywhere they are, they are arising against me, they, they, are, they are speaking against me. Father, raise a voice for me in the name of Jesus. Anywhere there are, pe there are people are speaking against me, there are people are rising against me. Oh Lord, raise a voice for me, O oh Lord. Father, raise a voice for me in the name of Jesus. Raise a voice for my children in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, raise a voice for me in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, raise a voice for me anywhere they are rising against me. Father, raise a voice for me in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, raise a voice for me. 
Oh, Lord, raise a voice for me. In the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. I want us to intercede for the saints. For the saints and for uh, women of God, men of God. Those that are out there preaching the word of God. I want us to intercede. Sister Elaine, can you please help us go to 2 Thessalonians chapter 3. Hallelujah. Verse 2. 2 Thessalonians chapter 3, verse 2. 2 Thessalonians chapter 3, verse 2. Yes, ma'am. And that we may be delivered from unreasonable and wicked men, for not all have faith. Amen. Amen. That we may be delivered, hallelujah, from unreasonable and wicked men. Say, O oh Lord our God, deliver the sin from the wicked men in the name of Jesus. All the sin out everywhere abroad, everywhere all upon this earth. Father, deliver the sin from the wicked men. Those that are preaching your word, the, 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 the women of God, the men of God, and those that are out on the field, the missionaries. O oh Lord our God, deliver them from the wicked men in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord, deliver them from the wicked officials in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, deliver them from unreasonable people in the name of Jesus. Deliver them from wicked people, wicked plants. Oh Lord, deliver them in the name of Jesus Christ. Deliver the same from the hands of the wicked men, from the hands of the wicked leaders in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah to the mighty God. Thank you, Jesus. Can you help us read verse 3, the next verse? Verse 3, but yes. the Lord who is faithful, who will establish you and guard you from the evil one. Amen. And we have confidence in the, I'm sorry, that was verse 4. No, it's okay. It's okay. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> and we have confidence in the Lord concerning you, both that you do and will do the things we command you. Amen. Say, oh Lord, my God, establish me and deliver me from evil. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, establish me and deliver me from evil in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my Father, establish the work of my hands and deliver my household from evil in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, establish me in the name of Jesus. Establish me, oh, Lord, and deliver me from evil in the name of Jesus. Oh, my Father, establish me and deliver me from the work of evil men in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, deliver me, oh, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Let us say, oh, Lord, our God, deliver the missionaries from the ends of the evil ones in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord our God, deliver the missionaries from the ends of the evil one in the name of Jesus Christ. All those that are on the field, in different places that are preaching the gospel on the street, Father, deliver them from the ends of the evil ones in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, deliver them. Oh Lord, deliver them in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let us plead the blood of Jesus. Let us plead the blood of Jesus. We 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 plead the blood. 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 We plead the blood of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' powerful name. Shout hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. I want everybody right now. You know, you have been praying since the day one of this program. You have been making your request known to the Lord. Now, I want everybody to just close your eyes and see the Lord doing all those things that you have asked. Just close your eyes now. I begin to see the Lord attending to all your requests. All those prayers you have been praying in the morning, at noon, at night, early in the morning. Even those where you woke up at night to pray, just close your eyes and see Jesus releasing answers right now. Just close your eyes, see Christ attending to your needs. And as you see him now, and the moment you see, you are convinced in your spirit, yes, I have received. Begin to thank the Lord. Begin to thank him for what he has done. Begin to thank him. Begin to thank him. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I can see your hands moving. 
I can see your hands moving. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, that you granted the desire of our heart. Thank you, Jesus, for you never deny the request of our lips. Thank you, Jesus, for the expectation of the righteous shall not be cut off, shall not be denied. Thank you, Jesus, for you are the God that answers prayer. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Begin to thank him. Begin to thank him. Begin to thank him. Father, we bless you. Father, we appreciate you. We give you all the glory. I thank you, Jesus, for your faithfulness. I thank you for your faithfulness. I thank you for your faithfulness. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Say, O oh Lord my God, stretch forth your hands and touch me and take away from me whatsoever that is not of you in my life. In the name of Jesus, O oh Lord my God, stretch forth your hands and touch me and take away from my life whatsoever that is not of you in my life. In the name of Jesus, O oh Lord my God, stretch forth your hands and touch me tonight and take away from me anything that is not of you in my blood, in my bones, in my body, in my eyes, in my head, in my brain, in my heart, in my liver, in my kidney, in my legs, in my knees, in my hands, in the name of Jesus. Almighty Father, stretch forth your hand and touch everyone on this call and take away from their lives whatsoever that is not of you in their finances, in their homes, in their spouse, in the name of Jesus. Mighty God, do mighty things. Mighty God, do mighty things. Mighty God, do mighty things in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Right now, just in your heart, sing a song to the Lord in your heart. Don't sing it out. Just close your eyes and sing a song. Let your heart sing a melody to the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Say thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Now let us pray. Oh, Lord, my God, give me power not to faint in the place of prayer. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, give me power not to faint in the place of prayer. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord my God, give me power not to faint in a place of prayer. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord my God, give me strength not to be weary. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord my God, give me strength, give me strength, give me courage not to be weary. In the name of Jesus, Father, oh Lord, renew my strength. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord my God, renew my strength. In the name of Jesus, Father, renew my strength. In Jesus' mighty name, hallelujah, hallelujah. Sister Elaine, please help us read Philippians chapter 3, verse 10. Hallelujah. Philippians chapter 3, verse 10. Yes, ma'am. that I may know him and the power of his resurrection and the fellowship of his sufferings and being conformed to his death. Hmm. Please help us read it again. That I may know him hmm. and the power of his resurrection and the fellowship of his, his sufferings being conformed to his death. Amen. Amen. Say, oh Lord, my God, Give me encounter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, give me encounter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. 
Oh Lord, my God, give me a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, my God, give me a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father, give me a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Father, give me a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Let me share this, this just to give us idea what that what that really means. Hallelujah. You see, was it last year or two years ago that Lord took me to a revelation? And I saw so many young men. They were perishing. You see, some of them they laid down without no with no strength. Some of them they laid down with like see as if they are lifeless. So I now saw that all of a sudden the Lord took me up. My feet were suspended from the earth. I was now moving without touching the ground. And I went to all those young men and I started laying hands on them and they started coming back to life. You see. So I woke up from that revelation and I knew that Lord is going to use me to revive some people very, very soon at that time. I didn't know who they had, but I saw their faces. So, not long, uh, I was in the church. You know, all of you know Sister Melinda, right? And they brought about what, seven young men, you know, six young men and one young lady. And with their parents, they brought them to me that they want me to pray for them. Oh, pray Jesus. And these young men, they were disobeying, they were disobeying, they were disobeying their parents. If it's even the way they dress at that time, everything, you know, the mother was crying inside. And as I began to, as I wanted to pray, Holy Spirit told me the power that is responsible for their disobedience. It took me to the scripture. That scripture, I want Sister Ellen to please read it. Uh, Ephesians chapter 4. No, sorry, Ephesians chapter 2. Epos read verse 2. Ephesians chapter 2, verse 2. Yes. In which you once walked according to the course of this world, mm -hmm. according to the prince of the power of the air, mm -hmm. the spirit who now was in the sons of disobedience. You see, you see the part that is responsible for disobedience. Power of the air. See, this, I didn't have that revelation before. I stood before them. Holy Spirit just took me to that scripture that I should tell all of them to say, power of the air, lose your hold over my life. All of them, that single prayer, they started falling off. You see, those of them that have all kind of worldly pendants, chains on their and their body started dumping into the dustbin right there in the church. The one that had their, their head like dreadlock, like all these worldly musicians, they were shouting, I'm going to cut it. You see, then Holy Spirit told me I should lay hands on them. They want to speak in tongues. These guys, they've not done water baptism. I said, who want to speak in tongues among you? All of them said yes. Some of them, before I even get to them, they started speaking tongues, falling down. I said, lay hands on some of them like this. They felt that place was like the upper room. And those boys, if you see them now, they are preaching the gospel. That is an encounter with the power of resurrection. You see, when you have a counter with power resurrection, it can never be hidden. In that revelation, I was moving, my feet was suspended from the earth. And I was moving to each of them. I was, I was laying sense on them. They were coming back to life. You see, so after those guys spoke in tongues, Holy Spirit now told me, do you know the scriptures are just be fulfilled through you now? I said, which scripture? He said, 
Peter, when he was preaching to Cornelius and his family, they were not baptized in water and uh, baptized before, and Holy Ghost fell upon them, and they began to speak in tongues. It was after that those boys now went to arrange for water baptism. You see, since that day, their lives will never remain the same. Because they had a counter with the power of resurrection. And so every one of us, some areas in our lives need a touch of that power. Say, oh Lord my God, let me have a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, let me have a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, give me a counter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, give me an encounter with your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. 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 So when when you when, as you hear that testimony, you know what it means to have a counter with that power. Every dead situation will be revived. Every dead organ will be revived. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say, oh Lord, my God, use me to demonstrate your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, use me to demonstrate your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, use me to demonstrate your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. You see, that was young boy. God wanted him to have the fear of God. You see, I went to their house. And now he was he was listening to a spelling, uh, spelling program on the TV. I think he has written down so many words, new words I was learning. So something just told me, only just told me to tell him that do you know, do you know I can tell you how many words you have written down? Even though I just came into their house. He said, no, you can never know. I said a thousand words. That boy screamed. He screamed. He said, how did you know that? Holy Ghost. Since that day, that boy was never the same. The note that he didn't show me. You see. God just wanted to give you an encounter. You see, God can give you an encounter in different ways. In different ways. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say, oh Lord, my God, have mercy on me. Let me not lack the experience of your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, have mercy on me. Let me not lack the experience of your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, have mercy. Let me not lack the experience of your power of resurrection in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, let me not lack the experience of your power of resurrection in Jesus' powerful name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want us to pray this prayer again. Say, oh Lord, my God, remember me, an open book of remembrance for me. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord my God, remember me, oh Lord, an open book of remembrance for me, oh Lord. In this program, Father, open book of remembrance for me. In the name of Jesus Christ, oh Lord my God, open book of remembrance for me. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. Say, oh God, that do new things. Do new things in my life for your glory. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, do new things in my life for your glory in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, do new things in my life for your glory in Jesus' mighty name. Mm. Say, oh, Lord, my God, have mercy on me. Clean up every area of my life that the enemy has messed up in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my Father, have mercy on me. Clean up every area of my life that the enemy have messed up in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, have mercy upon my children. Clean, clean up every area of their lives that the enemy has messed up in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. 
in Jesus' mighty name. Let us begin to thank God. Let us begin to thank God. Let us begin to thank God. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. We appreciate you. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Jehovah. Thank you, mighty God. Thank you, King of Kings. Thank you, Lord of Lords. Thank you, Ancient of Days. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, begin to cover your prayers with the blood of Jesus. Your testimonies with the blood of Jesus. Begin to cover your prayer with the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Jehovah. In Jesus' mighty name, any okay. scripture that the Lord lays in your heart in this period, don't joke with it. The Lord is speaking. Maybe you're praying a scripture just came to your mind, or you woke up with a scripture in your heart, or you woke up with a song in your heart. It's a message. Be expectant that the Lord will speak to you and don't lose it in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Anybody have any question or any anything to say before we round up? Sister Elaine will help us to round up in prayer. Anybody have any question or anything to say? Okay, pray Jesus, pray Jesus. Sister Elaine, please, can you round up for us in prayer? Hallelujah, Lord God. We just thank you for the mighty move of your word tonight, Lord God. We thank you for those who were able to come onto the Zoom, Lord God, and those who couldn't, Lord God, for being fed the word tonight, hallelujah, that is, is making us joyful, Lord God, to continue during this fasting and praying, Father God, standing up for your words, praying for those who are in need, Lord God, esteeming others higher than ourselves, Lord God. We just thank you again for this opportunity to come together as one, to have a mission in mind, Father God, to save those that have, are lost, to pray for those who are in need, to uplift those who are need encouragement, Lord God, and to just be mighty like the Lion of Yeshua, the Lion of Judah, Father God, to be bold for you, Father God, because uh, we love you, Lord God. We just, we praise you. We appreciate you, Lord God. And we want to reveal that to the world. We want to show the world the light. Hallelujah. We want to be the light that is in the darkness. And Lord God, I just ask that you continue to lift up the man of God who has a mission, Father God, who serves you with so much zeal. Hallelujah. That is being obedient to be the good shepherd, to, to share with us and to encourage us, Father God, as we desire to be your disciples here on this earth, Father God. And we just thank you for the for the rest of the week, Father God, as we wrap this up, that we continue to be excited about it. Hallelujah. And it, as we wait to see new miracles coming forth, Father God, and we give you all the glory and praise. In Jesus' name we pray, amen and amen. Amen, amen. Thank you, man. Amen. Thank you, I appreciate amen. everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We will meet again tonight. Please be, be strengthened. Try to have some rest so that we come back again to pray. Yes. And you see, this kind of fasting and prayer, we don't do it all the time. Mm -hmm. So let us take good use of it, every one of yes. us, to cry to God. To yes. cry, just have the attitude of Jacob. I will not let you go until yes. you bless me. Yes. God answers Hallelujah. prayer. God answers prayer. Thank you, just talk to him. Your supplication. You see, your intercession, your prayer, your cry. God hears our prayer. God hears his God at his go. He's, he's so happy, joyful when he sees his people, his children coming together like this. So are so many other churches coming together in one accord. You see, to pray, to fast. Please be encouraged. Don't don't lose, don't lose your strength. Don't don't lose your courage. Don't lose your hope. If you're praying. Definitely, there is a God that will hear our prayer. And God has been answering prayer. Hallelujah. Pray Jesus. As Sister Elaine was praying, the Lord ministered to me. Try to see in this period, something go from your hand to somebody. The needy. Those the needy that you know. It might not even be the homeless. It might be among your friends that you know. They are in need of particular thing that you have. Or it could even be the homeless. Just see that something goes out of your hand to somebody. You see, please, no matter how, it doesn't have to be big as you can afford. 
It could even be food stuff. It could be grocery that you go and shop for. You maybe you know some family they are struggling, just to bless them with it. Uh, it as she was praying, the Lord ministered that to me. Hallelujah! And we know that the scripture back it up. Even Jesus preached it several times. The Lord bless you. The Lord increase all of you, in the name of Jesus Christ. That your testimonies will not be denied. Every long issue in your home, in your family. That power of resurrection that we have requested, we touch it in the name of Jesus. We touch it in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah to the mighty God. I'm grateful to every one of you. I'm so much grateful and I'm interceding as well for everyone. Your testimonies are my testimony. Your testimonies are my testimony. That is why mm -hmm. I, I bow my knee before the God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. He wound the family of earth, family on earth and heaven, serve and bow, that he will grant your heart desire, he will grant your petitions. Hallelujah. That you will share your testimonies, the unbeliever will hear and ask, who is your God? Lead me to your God, and so shall it be in the name of Jesus Christ. Every long time situation in your life, in your family, that has brought a lot of body to you, the lifter of body will take it away in the name of Jesus. Our God, Christ, the lifter of body, will take it away. He has, he told us, he commanded us, come unto me, all ye that live and over body, and I will give you rest. And we are doing that right now. You will see that the Lord will give you that rest in the name of Jesus Christ. God bless you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Please, Sister Ellen Amen. and Sister Lisa, can you please let us just see for maybe for a few minutes. Yes, man. So God bless you, everybody. Enjoy your evening. Please try to have some sleep so that you can come back tonight. Sister. Yes, sir. God bless you. God Amen. Bless you. Thank you. Sister Sandri. Oh, she has gone. She has gone. Sister uh, Ede. I, I'm, I struggle I'm to. Fine. Yes, ma'am. Will Are you also coming tonight to join us for the midnight prayer? Yes, Pastor Sean. Uh -huh. This is Heidi. Uh, okay, I'm sorry, right. you're asking me? Uh -huh. Yes, I'm asking you if you also come in to join us tonight. Yes, sir, I will, definitely. Okay. okay, I will test you the Zoom details for that one. It's different from this one, okay? I'll test it to you. Oh, okay, sure. Pastor Sean, is it okay if I just call, use this number? Is that okay? Yes, it's okay, but you will need, I think you will need the code as well. The oh, yes, sir. Yes. I will send that yes, to you. Sir. I will send that to you. Great. Thank you so much, Pastor Sean. Bye-bye. God bless Bye. you. Amen. Good you night. Too. Bye. Thank you.